That's when you know football is the global game, where grannies and islands are, are getting it. Well, m well, my mother's a granny and she loves Mo Salah, so she, she's, she's into football and she'll be supporting Egypt, I think, this year. So she supports anybody but England every single time since I was a child. That's, it was always anybody but England. Really? Yeah, it was, um, it was Cameroon back in the day and then it was Ghana in 2010, so she just... Yeah, a Trinidad Tobago when they were playing against England. But she's failing the Tebbit test then, isn't it? She, does, she, she, does she live here? Yeah, she lives here. She's grown up here, but it was really interesting. So the game against Trinidad and Tobago in England, and she and, and she always said, I'm going to support whoever has more black players, whoever's playing against England has more black players. And at that time, actually, it was 50-50. So, um, but I think it's really interesting that Nigeria is kind of my team this year. Have you seen how they dress? Yes, everyone loves their kit. Well, everyone loves their kit. I can't quite see it myself. But then, if I don't like it, he's probably got something to yeah. say for it in fashion-wise. But, uh, Matt, you know, the Aussies, go on. The Aussies and Cajun have kind of nicked the, the Nigerian shirt. They've got a very similar one, but somehow they just don't carry it on.